lasted a mere nine years, from February 1811 until January 1820. In 1810, George III was taken seriously ill. He was declared incapable of ruling because of mental incapacity, and Regency Act was passed the following year, making his son George Prince regent to rule in his stead. The regency lasted until George III's death in 1820, when the regent became George IV and was able to rule in his own right. The regency is a period ruled by elegance and etiquette. It is a romantic world full of balls and duels, Corinthians and debutants, Almax and Vauxhall Gardens, and rakes reformed by love. Regency period fashion styles changed drastically by the emergence of emphasizing the empire silhouette. The style for women was fitted bodice and high waistline with light and free flowing fabric. The attire of all middle to upper class women required many layers. The first layer would be chemise or sometimes called shift. They were made of white linen and were extremely simple garments. They often had a drawstring at the neckline and were short sleeved or sleeveless. It was shorter than the dresses and was not intended to show at all. Another function of the chemise is that since it was worn at all times day and night, it was easy to wash, repair and replace when needed. During the Regency era, men's coats were cut away in front with long skirts or tails behind and had tall standing collars. The lapels featured an M-shaped notch unique to the period. Shirts were made of linen and had attached collars and were worn with stocks or wrapped in cravat tied in various fashions. One of the most beloved activities of the aristocratic and wealthy all through the long Georgian era was dancing. It was considered an essential accomplishment for both ladies and gents. For somewhere to show off one's voice and training as well as of of course to form and progress courtships and matches or simply to mingle, the ball had pride of the place. This was the most certainly true in Regency England. The privileged classes came together in public halls and private houses or even outdoors weather allowing to the dance night away. Balls might be immense events planned months in advance for hundreds of invitees. In large private mansions and country houses, they were also an opportunity to show off well and compete to the host most sought after ball of the season.